Hey guys, welcome to the video today. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to install these reusable dry filters on my shop vac and I'll go through this step by step. And there's a lot of information on this packaging, on the front of the packaging, and on the back of the packaging. So just make sure that you read through all of this information. It does say right here, Fitzmo Shop Vac brand wet dry vac. So just make sure that your shop vac is compatible with this reusable dry filter. And make sure to refer to your shop vac owner's manual for all the specifics on this process. Okay, so this is a three pack and I already have one of the filters installed on my shop vac and it also comes with this mounting ring here. Okay, so before we begin, you wanna make sure that you have on the proper safety equipment and take all safety precautions. I have on a pair of nitrile gloves, safety goggles, and a good quality mask. And then you need to make sure that the shop vac is both off and unplugged and make sure that the hose is out of the way. And take all of your accessories out of the tool holder. That way when you take the top of the shop vac off, they don't go all over the place. Okay, so the next thing that I'm going to do is take the top of the shop vac off and I put a shirt off to the side here because we're going to turn the top upside down and I don't want to scratch the top of the shop vac up. Okay, so there are two latches, one on each side here, and I'm just going to undo those like so. And now I'm going to take the top of the shop vac off, and I'm just gently turning this over and gently setting it down onto the t-shirt. Okay, so the next thing that I'm going to do is to take off the mounting ring, and I'm just lifting up on the mounting ring on all sides until the mounting ring comes off. And then we can take the mounting ring and the dry filter off like so. Okay, and this is the foam sleeve. And you just want to make sure that the foam sleeve is on the outside of the groove all the way around the shop vac. And just make sure that the foam sleeve is installed correctly all the way around the bottom of the foam sleeve and the top of the foam sleeve. Okay, so now I'm taking the dry filter and I'm placing it on the top of the filter cage. And right in the middle here it says center on filter cage, so that's what I'm doing. And then once we have this centered here, I'm just going to start to form the dry filter around the foam sleeve like so. And then I'm going to take the mounting ring and I'm placing this over the top of the dry filter and starting to move the mounting ring downwards. And you want to make sure that the dry filter is completely covering the foam sleeve and it also needs to be coming out of the bottom of the mounting ring all the way around. Okay, so now I'm going to finish pushing down the mounting ring and when you do this, it does get tougher to do as you get towards the bottom here. Um, but you just want to make sure to work it down from all the different sides until you get it secured all the way into place like so. Okay, so when I was pushing the mounting ring down, this part of the dry filter got tucked up underneath the mounting ring, so I just pulled this part of the dry filter out. Okay, so I'm about to put the top of the shock back on, and you want to make sure that the hose is out of the way, that way you don't trip over it. And I'm going to put the filter into the middle of the filter bag and line up where the latches go, and then gently set down the top of the shock back like so. Okay, so now I'm going to re-secure both of the latches, the one on this side and the one on this side. All right, guys, well, that was it for this video, and I hope it's been helpful, and thank you so much for watching. And I do have other shop vac videos, and I'll link those videos at the end of this one. And if you're interested and have time, please check those videos out. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Have a good one. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And if you have the time, check out these other great videos.